Hey guys and welcome back to my channel and to my new video. It's been a long time since I did something so colorful like this. For the past couple of months I was so caught up in the commissions that I haven't got any chance to do something creative and to get out of my comfort zone. I wasn't thinking too much about the ending result. All I wanted to do is just experiment and practice with my colored pencils and combining the colors the way that I thought it will look good. For this drawing I used Strapmore Bristol Bore 300 series and Prismacolor Premier colored pencils. I just took all of my colored pencils and to be honest I haven't planned what shades will I be using exactly, I just went with any kind of shades that I felt like at the moment. Since my commissions were mostly in graphite pencils I really missed using the colored pencils or anything regarding the colors, so I really enjoyed working on this piece. This idea came to me while I was preparing to bed a couple of days ago. I just saw it in my head how it might look like with a bit of geometry, so I was really excited to start off with the drawing. That I haven't slept much that night because once that picture popped in my head I was so excited and afraid that I might forget about it in the morning, so instead of sleeping I decided to get out of the bed and start immediately with sketching and drawing. Um, anyways, this is far away from my best drawing, uh, but practicing and getting out of the comfort zone is something that I think every artist, whether a professional one or a beginner, should do. We easily get caught up in the things that goes the best for us, so we just continue doing that every day because we see that we're doing good. But the best part when it comes to art is experimenting, trying out different things, different mediums, different techniques. Trying out different approaches to drawing or painting, anything that can help you move your creativity a bit further. Most of us are mostly afraid whether we're gonna totally fail when we try something new, so we usually stick with that what we do best. But we need to realize that even if it doesn't turn out the way that we want, in the end of the day we learned something new, we built up our knowledge a bit more, we experienced something different. And I think that that's what art is all about, because I don't believe in bad drawing or bad art. It's just creations that we like more or less. There is no right or wrong art, it is just our way of looking at some creations. Basically nobody can tell you if it's uh, good or bad, because there is no measurements when it comes to art. It's just our subjective way of looking at a particular piece from person to person, if that makes any sense to you now. Um, Anyways, for the past couple of months I have felt like I stopped growing, so I decided to devote this year to my growth as an artist and to experiment as much as I can, so I truly encourage you to do that as well. Try out different mediums, different approach to drawings, don't think too much about the ending result, just experiment and grow. Sometimes it will feel like you're going backwards and not forwards, which is totally normal because we're doing something for the first time, but that doesn't mean it is bad, it's just a part of our development. You saw here that I started off with the hair because I feel the most comfortable drawing the hair. I was so scared to start off with the face, but once I started off I realized how much fun that actually is and how interested it can be drawing the face in all these colors. I ended up having more fun shading the face than shading the hair and you all know how much I love drawing the hair. So you never know where the whole process of experimenting and pushing yourself off the limits will lead you. You might discover that you love doing something different more or that you prefer some other medium to create as long as you experiment and have the courage to do it. Who knows where that might lead you and how much you will progress. So I looked at this as an experiment, what will move me, what will inspire me and what will be the most interesting thing for me to work on this piece. I know this could turn out so much better, but um, I was pretty happy how my brain worked during this whole process that I haven't cared much about um, the ending result and whether the drawing will turn out good or not. Um, all in all, the best thing that you can do for yourself is to get out of the comfort zone and always make yourself grow as an artist through different styles, different mediums, different approaches, anything basically that is different from what you got used to and not care much about how it's gonna look or is it gonna look perfect or not or is it gonna be accepted from other people or not. The most important thing is going through the whole process of creating something unique, something that nobody has ever created before and to feel good while creating it. The less you think about it and the more you enjoy the process, the ending result will be so much better. 
I know that it is so much easier said than done, but try to keep that in mind every time you have the desire to create something new. Anyways guys, if you came this far, thank you so much for watching this video, I truly hope you like this drawing. If you like the whole process of creating it, please give this video a thumbs up and if you haven't, please subscribe to my channel. That will mean a lot to me, there will be loads of drawings and loads of creative videos. Also I will link my all social medias in the description box so you can check out some of my other work. If you have any questions, suggestions or anything you want to share with me and with other people, be free to share it in the comment section down below, I would be more than happy to hear from you. Thank you all so much again and I will see you soon in another video. Bye bye guys!